study, I'm in a good mood, I'm just jamming to my music. Anyway, I hope it's not too loud for you. I want to go ahead and let you know what has been going on with me, especially since the last, well, I should say not the last vlog, but the one before that, where I was just totally depressed and not in the right frame of mind. Well, okay, since then, I went, I told you that I was going to do one day of loading. I actually did two days of loading. I figured I'd better get that second day in and look good. So, the first day, I can't even remember what I ate, but it was about everything I could think of and um, everything that is unhealthy and not good for me. And let's just say it was a sad diet, you know, standard American diet, sad diet. The second day, I kind of started by loading around 11 o'clock, maybe noon. Um, just to let you know, my son and I went to Lowe's and we got me a, well, it's a barbecue grill, but it's not gas and it's not propane. It's actually wood burning, so it's also a smoker. So that night we came home and we grilled up uh, steaks and we actually my son grilled them and a lot of them came out with charcoal. But they were still good. Still ate them. And I made some potato salad, so I had two big, huge, healthy potato salads. Um, sorry about the food corn for those of you who are disgusted by it and can't have it at this point or may want it. And I do apologize for that. Uh, so that's what I did. Um, I'm sorry I'm looking down at my nose. Throw this thing out. But anyway, uh, the first day of my P2, okay, was actually yesterday. I had my perfect steak, a little bit of it, and I had strawberries for lunch. And for dinner, I made a chicken and uh, cabbage soup. Which is really good. I added a little bit of butter for it, with the cooking oil and the chicken, so it's it to us. There's no sugar in it, no sugar, so it's super low sugar and like that. So, it is a key to energy from it. Um, I almost went to my dad's home, and I came across a bread bar, a chocolate bread bar that I had bought for a little bit only. And apparently I didn't see it, and I got that that I started unwrapping it, and I made a little couple of squares off of it, and I said, hey, I can't stop it. So I took the whole thing, and with the crowd of me, didn't even with didn't even my fingers. I took it down the and I gave it to my mother and left, and then when we did it, it was just so I can't stop it. And then I came back upstairs, washed my hands, and did not want to smell chocolate. Um, so I'm feeling good about that. I did almost do it, but I didn't fall. This is a good thing. Um, today, I had made, um, that's what I'm sorry. Yesterday, I had also had coffee. I made with the pot of this world, strawberry lemonade and coffee bowl. It was so good. I'll put a picture of it to the end of the video. Uh, what I did was I took a whole container of strawberries, little plastic containers. I put the, I washed the strawberries, put the whole thing in there, along with the uh, smooth on top of the strawberries. Hey, you know, no need to pull them off, just wash them off. So good. And I, I squeezed two whole lemons to get to it as well. And I put a little bit of TV in it, and I turned my vitamin to on and curated it. And then I filled my popsicle cup, and they came out so good. I had one last night, and I had one this morning. Um, to, uh, what I did this morning was I boiled I two trays of the family size trays of chicken tenders and froze them in, in the kitchen, you know, to a big stack. And for lunch today, I don't know if this is. Really bad. I figured it was probably good for the sense of fast and set. Nutritional yeast has all your, you've got, you've got your yeast, 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 you've got your yeast,
I boiled the whole head of cauliflower. And then I put that into my Vitamix and I pureed it. I added a little bit of salt, a little, a little Himalayan salt, a little bit of pepper, and added about a tablespoon of nutritional yeast so it would come out tasting cheesy to me. That's the one nice thing about nutritional yeast. You can taste like cheese. Um, and I added about a teaspoon of um, organic uh, chicken powder. I mean, it has salt in it, but it doesn't have the added sugar, and I get it from an oriental market down the road from us. And I made uh, that, and it was just amazing. It came out like full potatoes, but it was so, good. It was so much better because it actually had potatoes, or it actually had a cheesy taste to it. And the cauliflower actually has more flavor, I believe, than the regular white potatoes. Um, so it was really delicious, and I had my, a little baggie of my um, two chicken tenders in it, and I put those in the hot water and, and brought them to a nice heat temperature, and had that along with it for lunch. Um, tonight, I think what I'm going to do is do a um, chicken salad, maybe, with the ch two chicken tenders, and break them up on top of my spinach leaves, and I think what I'm going to do is make like strawberry dressing. And what I use with that, oh, this is that. Let's go back here. <laughs> anyway, when you, you also want to put stevia in when you make them soft, it just makes them sweet. Because the lemon will make them very tart. Okay, now let's stuff with a little more. Okay, anyway. <laughs> oh, I like that little animation. Anyway, um, I think I'm going to have that with my. Um, Strawberry dressing, what I what I like to do is go ahead and blend about three strawberries in the Vitamix, a little bit of lemon juice in it, add a little bit of stevia, and a little bit of uh, pepper and garlic powder, and you just go right there. So I think that's what I'm going to do for dinner. I'm feeling really good. I drank, actually, I had this whole thing filled with water. Now I've got it filled with um, it's uh, almond and almond and green tea, uh, almond flavoring and green tea. It's a loose leaf tea that I that I make, um, and also I had a black coffee this morning from Quick Trip. Okay, this is one of the convenience stores out here. I had a plain black coffee. Got my empty jar. And this is my lemon and my lemon stevia and strawberry uh, drink that I have for today. And I am drinking a lot. I mean a lot. I'm not working today, so I'm enjoying my day off. I wanted to show you a couple things that I've been doing. I know back there it's supposed to be my art studio set up. I haven't gotten a tape yet, uh, but I eventually will, so I can go ahead and set it up. Uh, these are some paintings that I created. This one here. Oh, you can see it's great. It is textured, and it's the mountains with the white cloud. I did that, and I also did another one that was more like an abstract. This one has some blues and some greens, and it's a whole the white. Which is over this way. Uh -huh. I don't know if you can see that. The coloring's not coming out too well, but it is it's completely textured, completely dry. And then we've got a flower here in the middle. Let's see if I can get the light to hit just right. Because off this camera, it's not coming out to where you can actually see the colors. But you can see, like, like right up in here, all of this here, the color underneath. That's actually the silver. There's the silver. Um, hmm. Let's see. Can I bring any more color out? Uh, under here is like a um, pearl. And. Hmm. Uh, right 
the next my monitor went blank. Okay. Right in here. Over here. Mine is good coordinated. Yeah, I have some turquoise green under here. I do apologize. It's not the colors underneath that's not coming out well. Uh, but I've just been kind of playing around with it. I put black gesso on top of the uh, the white canvas. Anyway, that is some of my artwork I've been kind of messing around with a bit. So I do want to really get my art studio set up. Um, other than that, let's see. that's about it. But anyways, I want to go ahead and say hello to everyone and uh, let you know that today is a very good day for me. Uh, Lori, let some more. I tried taking your call this morning and hopefully you'll be a yell back. Uh, I do want to go ahead and I'm sorry I'm looking away at this moment, but I am actually looking for something that I can't get on here. Because there is a story that I was watching. Let's see if I can find it. Let's see. I'm going to do my little bit of cases that I've got over here. And I apologize. Uh, I'm not seeing it. I can't think what her name is. But she is um, she's incredible. I was watching her. And uh, she is really, 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 really into um, the HCG and the protocol. And I wish I remembered what her name was. I friended her this morning and and like me. Give me one moment. Hmm. Okay, this is not good. Hmm. Talk to you all later, and you have a great day. Bye-bye.